What's going on, world? This is Kobe Hicks, national executive here in Vacation Travel, soon to be international executive, guys, as I make this diamond run. I just wanted to drop a quick video, and, and, and this isn't for just Vacation Travel. This can be applied to any company in the network marketing industry. Uh, this video is what to do when you start your new business. How do I start my new business? And, and, and here, here it is in four quick steps for you guys. The first thing you wanna do when you're starting any business, guys, is you wanna invest, okay? That's the first thing you wanna do. So after you've invested your money, you've done that, you know, realize that and give yourself a pat on the back, okay? And, and don't pat too long because then we move to step two, okay? Step two is you wanna make a list of 100 plus names. You want at least 100 names, preferably more. The more, the better, guys. And we're not just slapping names on the paper, uh, just any Joe Blow. Guys, we're writing down names of people that we think would be serious about business, people we would, wouldn't want to make, uh, we wouldn't mind making money with, people we like to have fun, guys. And if you're on my team, guys, we have a memory jogger, guys. And, and if you go through that memory jogger, you can actually build a strong list of 100 plus names and reach out to these people guys the third thing you want to do when starting your new business is learn the language and the language is simple it's form and form is an acronym family occupation recreation and money okay and the reason we want to learn the language is because this is how we're going to speak to those people on, on that list we made okay when we call these people we're not calling them to pressure them or to push our business on them guys we're calling them to ask hey how's your family doing What's your occupation like? What are you doing nowadays? What are you doing for fun nowadays in 2015? You know, that's the recreation part. Now, what are you doing to stay ahead financially in 2015? Or in this 2015 economy? Or in a down economy? That's form, guys. Family, occupation, recreation, and money. You always want to form your prospects, guys. The fourth thing to do when starting you to uh, know when starting your new business is edification. You want to understand edification. And here's four critical parts that you have to touch in order to make money in this network marketing industry and especially in vacation, guys. You want to be sure that you say he or she's making a lot of money, knows 100% of the information, having a lot of fun, and helping a lot of other people do the same thing. Okay, that's critical, guys. And here's why. Because we have four types of people. Okay, and you don't know which type your prospect may be. We have dolphins urchins whales and sharks guys and real quickly dolphins are those who like to have fun okay dolphins like to travel they'll go out and they'll have a good time that's the pro to the dolphin guys but the flip side to that is that's all they'll do and then we have the whales guys the whales are, are, are very persuasive you know the whales are very persuasive and the whales they love helping people and the fact that they love to help people guys that's the pro to the whale and the con is that they're very persuasive and then guys, we have sharks. Sharks are your people who are money hungry. Sharks are people who love the compensation plan. They love the three by seven matrix, guys. Sharks are gonna get out there and go after it, okay? That's the pro to the shark. But the disadvantage to the shark is that sometimes they're so aggressive that they'll push people away from the business, from what they're presenting, guys. And then, of course, we have our urchins. Our urchins, they love knowledge. Our urchins, they love to book travel, guys. They love uh, getting certified for the different vendors, guys. They love learning all of the information that they can learn. That's an advantage to the urchin. But the disadvantage to the urchin, guys, is sometimes that they learn so much. They fill their heads with so much knowledge that they don't even move. They become stagnant, guys. So you want to understand that when, uh, when understanding the concept of edification, guys. And here's the question you always want to be sure you ask your prospect, okay? After edifying, you always want to be sure to say, hey, do you have 30 seconds to get on the phone with Kobe Hicks? Or do you have 30 seconds to get on the phone with whoever your upline is? Okay, subscribe to me on YouTube, youtube.com backslash Kobe Hicks one. Uh, add me here on Facebook. I'm also on Instagram at Kobe Hicks one. We'll see you guys at the Bank Beach or on the next vacation.